Hi everyone, welcome back to another video of Framer Motion. Mm, in previous videos, we explained text animation using Framer Motion in ReactJS and also Enter and Exit animation. In this video, we will um, uh, create an example for draggable objects. Drag uh, animation, or we can call that in Framer Motion, gesture type animations, which related with depend on the action of user. Gest gesture type animation mean to depend on the action of users like h o or and mouse over and and drag and others and tap so this is a double uh, draggable objects which i have created these uh, three um, boxes so the first one is no constraint it means no constraint it is pre wherever you would like to drag you can drag it okay it is free you can go like this sorry so it has no constraint the second one is drag y only it means that it is just draggable on y side and x side it is not draggable just on y side okay you can drag it just on once y side and the third one is the um, drag constraint it we applied constraint on it it means on y side it is free to drag but on x side it is constraint it means to this side just 50 or how much pixel is it and the right side just 100 okay it can go ahead and also on this side it is between 100 0 and 100 pixel okay in this area and x we apply the constraint so we will get this example so before starting please subscribe our youtube channel so let's get started so first of all you have to install the framer motion package okay using npm install um, framer motion or yarn add framer motion i have already installed it it's here framer motion it's okay framer motion and i have created a file framer animation and i imported it in the index page okay so let's write our code now so first of all i will import framer mo the motion from framer motion okay we will use this motion component so let's create uh, oh, react functional component and here we will write our code now and it has exported first I will get an h1 tag so here I should write draggable Objects with framer motion and let's apply some styles style and it style text align center. Now I will create a view element sorry yeah I will style this view I have added this style to the this view element display flex flex selection row gap between these rows 200 pixel align item center justify content center and margin top 80 it will be 120 okay so now let's create other views in this view okay these are the boxes that we would like to create okay in the first one i should write no constraint okay no constraint no limitation on this now let's create a view here and this should be our uh, draggable object so we should it means that we would like to animate this element so we should use our motion uh, component here sorry come here and just add before this motion that new okay it is now our animated element so now we will uh, add the properties to this uh, first I will add some styles to this okay width and height 
the fade to be like 100 pixel and also and also background would be blue and just add this property drag okay it means that it is draggable now and we didn't apply any constraint and this so it is the first um, draggable object that we have created so now let's copy this one Okay, this div I will copy this div and paste it here and it should be y only constraint okay it means if you would like to make it x only or y only that depends on your constraint okay I will make it just y only constraint and also the style width and this should be here and just we will add our constraint now here drag is equal to y it is just draggable on y drag y only and now let's paste that again to add more constraint on this constraint and these are the same just now we will add another property that is drag constraint okay so is equal to now we will add to the left side it will goes to the zero and to the right side it can goes up to 100 pixel okay by default it is pixel and let's check it I already started the server in fame start so it is just y only draggable not on x side it is no constraint on this you can drag everywhere and uh, drag constraint didn't apply so let's check it so, so we should add the drag constraint it here it here we should add the drag property and let's check it now it can move on y side okay but on the x side it can goes up to 0 and 100 pixel okay to this you can also add uh, the um, other property like type like top okay for, for example on the top it can goes up to minus uh, 100 pixel okay to the top it can goes means to the minus side to the top side okay just to the 100 okay it can go up So it was all about uh, draggable objects uh, with framer motion using React.js. So if you like the video, so please subscribe our YouTube channel. Thanks for watching.